Hey there, collectives, and welcome back for another general love reading. Shout out to all of you beautiful mates and people who are returning back to my channel. Thank you so much. Thank you for like, sharing, and subscribing to this channel. I really, really do appreciate you. So this is a general love reading for the collective. Uh, only take the part that fits and disregard the rest. If it does resonate with your energy, I invite you to please like, share, and subscribe and become a part of this beautiful channel. So you have gifts coming your way, okay? So as I was pondering this energy, uh, it is a general, by the way. Uh, as I was pondering this energy, not only do you have a very, very strong soulmate connection that is heading your way, um, e either this person is coming into your life to help you. It's almost like your other half balancing out your life. <clears throat> I see somebody single doing everything on their own and this person coming into your life to balance you out and you're going to have something for them that they need. Um, I see gifts here, but spirit was also telling me that make no mistake about a collective. You are the gift. Okay. You got gifts coming in, but you are the gift. I remember, <clears throat> I remember somebody, somebody made a comment in the comment section said that I talk too much. <laughs> I can't, I mean, I got to talk to do your reading. So if I'm channeling and, and telling you stories, it's all a part of the reading. So please don't come for me and how I do me. I love y'all, but God damn, you can't control everything, okay? So I remember meeting this guy here and um, he said something about, I saw him not too far from my neighborhood because it was a neighborhood furniture store. I stopped up there one day. And so one day, anyway, we ended up talking, ended up, I, I went on a date with him. And he made the statement of, he said, I was trying to get this house that you were living in. He said, because I really thought, he said, but now that I see it, it really wasn't the house. It was who was in the house. <laughs> he said, now I see it wasn't the house. It was who was in the house. Needless to say, he was a Capricorn and I couldn't get down. But yeah, collective, you are the gift. You are the prize. Okay. You do have this, this very familiar energy, the soulmate connection. This is a past life relationship. You're going to feel an instant connection with this person. It's going to be like, ooh, la, la, la. It's like that deja vu energy. Like you've been here before. You're going to see it in their eyes. They say the window of your soul is through your eyes and you're going to feel that instant connection. For some of you guys, you're going to meet this connection while you are out traveling. And others, this person is traveling to you. You do have the tower moment. You could be a Scorpio. I feel like out of nowhere it's going to happen. Two of one. See, somebody going to fall in love here. Somebody going fi to find love on a two-way street here. Queen of Cups, you could be a Cancer, Scorpio, or Pisces. You got the tower here. Two of Wands, Leo, Sagittarius, and Aries looking out of, uh, up the horizon. Uh, decisions, choices. And while you're contemplating here, collective, you're going to meet this right one. So for some of you guys, you're manifesting while you are looking out on the horizon and thinking about who fits into your life. And see, little do you know, they are on their way to you, honey. Yeah, they coming in. See, ooh, you got big papa coming in. The emperor, followed by the nine of pentacles here. So you got the devil card here. And you have judgment. Now, it does say past life, and they go to magician. For some of you guys, this could be somebody here from your past. And others, this is just a past life connection here. But either somebody is coming into you that is single, that has a lot to offer. They're financially stable here. They're independent here. And like I say, you somebody about to fall in love with uh, Big Papa here. Because I feel like Big Papa is coming in to help got the Knight of Pentacles. So I feel like the Knight of Pentacles and the Nine of Pentacles is letting you know that this person is financially stable here. This could be a business owner here, some somebody here who lives alone, does things alone here. Once again, like I say, coming back in to balance things out. Could be a Libra, could be an Aries, could be a Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn here. Cancer, Scorpio, and Pisces. All right, Spirit, what's going on for the collective? You got that Capricorn energy. This could be a workaholic here too. Like I say, you could meet this person while you're traveling. This could be somebody that you meet while you're traveling and they're working. I just saw a hard hat here. Somebody may be have their own construction business here and you meet them while you park. Then they on the side of the road. See, and like I say, unexpectedly, love is going to happen here. 
I, I feel like what's see and there they go again. See, like I said, I go that emperor and that ace of cup, that emperor looking for some love, baby. Ooh, wee. See, so they find okay, so they're looking for somebody here who I feel like there's gonna be an instant connection. This person's gonna be instantly turned on by you with the ace of cups, the emperor. And that ace of wands here, this is someone here who finds you beautiful and attractive here, or they could be an attractive person here. Like it could be a fire sign, it could be a Leo, Sagittarius, or Aries, because you got the Aries with the emperor. You got Some of y'all, you're dealing with Aries and Scorpio, because you got the tower, the emperor. You got the emperor twice here. So like I say, it's going to be an unexpected surprise, a pleasant surprise, because you're not looking for this. You're not expecting this. Now, what's up with this queen of cups for the collective? Clarify this queen of cups. Cancer, Scorpio, and Pisces. <clears throat> yeah, yeah, I just got back in from uh, working out. So put this little jacket on to um, warm my body. Ooh, now see. We're clarifying the Queen of Cups, and this just flew out. See there? See? It's love in the air for somebody. Somebody looking for love. I told you, you got a boss that's looking for love, honey. Like I say, and this person is extremely passionate. They are a go-getter. Like I say, they're attractive. Somebody looking to plant some seeds. Somebody looking to invest. I said Big Papa is looking for the right connection to invest in. Mm. You got the king and the queen of cups. Like I say, you're going to fall in love with this one. Because they're going to treat you right. This could be somebody, if you're still having children, you're going to have babies with this one. She going to wear my ring. I just heard, uh, there goes my baby. There she go again. See, there's somebody looking for some love for real. Could be a water sign. Could be a water sign that's about to fall in love when they least expect it here. See? Somebody's looking for success. Somebody wants to be a successful partner, a successful union, or somebody's coming in here to get your attention. I feel like they're going to get it. And I feel like this person's coming in to make all of your wishes come true. So for some of you guys, if you've been dealing with a heartbreak, see, you could tell with the soulmate. See, there it is, soulmate. They're coming in with the gifts. And you're going to sense a very strong past life deja vu connection with this person. And I see it with the king and the queen of cups. This could be somebody here who you've all, always wished for. The type of energy that you dreamed of with this moon card. Some of you guys could have been dreaming for this connection here. Why is the two of wands here for the collective? You got Aquarius energy. Two of wands for the collective spirit. Why is the two of wands here? Mm. Decisions, planning. Somebody's looking for a partner. Somebody's looking for a mate here, thinking very logical. Somebody's looking for the right match. Somebody feels like it's good to be in love here. See, page of cups here. I feel like this is somebody here who uh, is, I feel like whoever this person is, I feel like this, this, this is something that somebody has been thinking about for a very, very long time. Maybe they wasn't focused on that. Maybe they was a businessman here. Maybe this is somebody here who, um, ordinarily was not uh, looking for relationships <clears throat> until they meet you. They're going to realize that there, there is a special person for them and it is you. And I feel like you're going to, you're going to, you're going to, you're going to, I feel like once this person makes contact with you, they're going to instantly want you and y'all going to fall in love together. Now, why is the nine of Pentacles here for the collect? Y'all going to fall in love together. I feel like this is a relationship that you get to fall in love together. You know, you ain't got to catch up, hope that they love you and you already in love with them type of energy. No, y'all about to fall in love together. Ooh, we nine of Pentacles for the collective towards Virgo and Capricorn. Why is this nine of Pentacles here? You could be single. Mm, justice. Libra energy. So somebody here wants to, ooh, we. I heard that shit. Somebody say, ooh. Somebody says here, look here. Now, I got a lot to offer. I ain't tripping about that. But since I do have a lot to offer, then I love myself too enough to know that I need to have the right mate for me. Just not know anybody is going to do for me the emperor. I need my life to be balanced with the right one. Ooh, hoo, hoo. 
Libra energy. I heard that. See? So you got the emperor in here twice. Now you got that empress and you got the king and the queen of cups. See? <laughs> Ooh, this is juicy, see? Like I said, somebody probably gonna want some children. You guys could already have children. What's up with this nine of pentacles? Somebody's looking for the right one. Now, for some of y'all, <clears throat> could be somebody coming in from your past here with the four cups here. It could be somebody not happy with or afraid that, that you may reject them if it's somebody coming in from your past because of some things that maybe they have did. But they trying to balance things out. They trying to make it right. Somebody trying to make it right. So if this is somebody here who did you wrong, they're trying to make it right with you now. Because they recognize that the connection that you two have uh, is otherworldly. And they have not found such connection in anybody else. It's about you and your person. Now what's up with this emperor again, Aries? See, for some of y'all, it's your person. They regret a lot of things. So your person's coming in to gift you. Your person's coming in to spoil you, to treat you like they've never treated you before. And I feel like it took this person a time to really think about this with the King of Swords. And somebody realizes that they do have feelings for you and they want to. It's almost like with the two of wands, the King of Swords. The page of cups and the magician is almost like somebody had to really think about some things. And what they are realizing here is that you have uh, awakened emotions in them that they long suppressed and they want to explore and get to know more of this. And somebody can easily see y'all loving each other together with the king and the queen of cups with the six of wands and the star. See, it's almost like for, for somebody here. You make them want to love you. You make them want to love again. You inspire them to love again. And you're the right one, the emperor. <clears throat> Eight of wands. So like I said, once again, this could be about travel because you do have travel here. Some of you guys could be traveling when you meet somebody, if it is somebody new. But I know you got new opportunities. You have the ace of wands and the ace of, uh, ace of cups. So there's definitely love and passion here. Why is the emperor here for the collective? Could be a divine mask in here. They go that tower card here. See, like I said, you're not going to see the, y'all not going to see your emperor coming, whoever this person is, but you got your boss though. You ain't, you ain't got no, you ain't got the employees or the workers, baby. You got the boss. But then again, you're showing up as the boss too. So I can see how this is a very good connection here. See, I told you, gifts, there they go. There it is. There them gifts go. They coming in here to be generous, God dang it, because they got it. See, see, see? Six of Pentacles from Big Papa. Knight of Pentacles, see? Knight of Pentacles say, so you know what? I'm looking for the right one. There go that twin flame with the king and the queen of cups, the emperor and the empress. See, some of y'all have been waiting for this. And like I say here, you might, while you're out traveling, you're going to meet somebody or somebody is traveling into your hometown where you could meet this person while you're going into a store and they could be at the gas pump traveling and they see you and it's an instant connection. When I tell you love can happen anyway, I mean, see somebody, ooh, we, the lover, see? <laughs> This your person here, the temperance card, see? This the one you have been patiently waiting for, collective. You could tell that this is the one you have been patiently waiting for, you've been wishing for, longing for, manifesting, because it seems like everything that you want, you're going to get. Everything that you have waited for, and like I said once again, you are not going to see this coming. You're not. And I feel like this is good because you won't you won't try to interfere. You will just you won't second guess it or, you know, no. When it was both of these tower cards here, you're not going to see this love happening. So it can happen naturally. You're going to look up and you're going to be in a whole relationship and you're going to be happy collective. But this is your reading and this is the energy that is surrounding the collective in love currently. So if this video resonates, please like, share and subscribe. Bye.